Good morning. Today I'm giving a review for The Skip Back School by Marguerite de Angeli, published in 1939. Marguerite de Angeli is an author that I really like. This is the second book of hers that I've read. The first one I read was Door in the Wall, which was amazing. This one was good too, not quite as good as Door in the Wall. I loved Door in the Wall, but I do like this. It is about a boy named Eli who doesn't really like school very much. He'd rather be outdoors. He'd rather be building things with his hands. And he gets into a lot of mischief. He broke a window at his school. He can't seem to focus on what he's doing, keeps staring out the window. And he has a wonderful teacher named Master Christopher. And Christopher, well, Master Christopher, because he's the teacher. They call him Master back in the olden days. So his teacher, Master Christopher, teaches him to focus, teaches him to be more interested in listening and being obedient instead of just wanting to do what he wants to do all the time. It's a good little story. It's not very long. It's just 92 pages. This is the second time I've read it. I read it two years ago with my oldest and I just finished it this week with my next child. And I do like it. I appreciate the message of hard work and persistence, even in something that you don't really particularly like to do. I do like that it has scripture throughout and I like the historical aspect of it. It deals with a time when people from Germany came over to the United States and they built towns and they had their own communities and they taught their children in these little schools. This being the Skipback School. So I highly recommend it. Marguerite, anything by Marguerite DeAngeli, I feel like would be beneficial. Door in the Wall was very good as well. This one did not disappoint. And I have another book by her that I have not read yet, but I'm looking forward to seeing what that one's all about as well. So I hope you have a good weekend and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.